to, to start playing. And look how like, cute Nar is. I mean, come absolutely. on, all, all babies love Nar. Annie's around. She's even got a teddy bear, so there's like an right, easy transition. Right, let's, let's dial this back. You guys at home, it is the last regularly scheduled game. There are implications for tiebreakers and standings at LL Esports. Hit us up, hashtag AHQWin or hashtag SKTWin. Very briefly, as the analyst desk were alluding to, it is AHQ fighting for we the We see right. very early focus on the bottom side from Mountain A. We know this is the strategy often from AHQ, camp for Anne. He's taking a very different route. Over the wall, he's going in. Well, he's going to be looking for the knockup. Found Bang gets him up. He's got the red buff ticking. That's a flash forward. But Wolf is going to be able to flay them backwards. Wolf continues to chase back. Into the oh! Just sentence. Mountain, look out him. Flash away. And first blood to SKT Wolf. And look at the player. Top lane first. And it's going to be Zim now getting jumped on. He does have flash pops and gets away from the house. But SKT is going over towards the mid lane. The Rift's going to look at the bottom this. river pass. This is so scary. If they push going into the turn, they're going to try anyway. Here they go. Knock up on the Bang. There's the chilling spot. My bang's in trouble! AHQ get one on the board and it lands in Anne's hands! Hit level 6, Ziv's got to be real careful how soon can Mountain get up there, but so much damage taken by the minions means Meganar just kind of get angry for no reason. <laughs> so let's slow this down a second. Yeah. One to one in kills, 800 gold ahead. Is no choice, sure time to slow oh! down! Oh! See ya! That was easy. <laughs> that was a little too easy for Westall. The flash feast and dinner is served. We looked up bottom lane. Anne and Albus now in retreat. Wolf and Bang get the teleport in from Marin. The flay into auto attack secures the kill. And Marin's looking for blood. He's going to get an assist on the second one. And SKT with an easy turnaround. Looks like Mountain wants to once again return to bottom lane. Same route for him. He just tunneled over the wall here. He plays it with that's a teleport. But the flash, they're all up. No ult for Bang, though. Will this be enough with the damage? Because Zip comes in. No TP at all for Morin. On pulls the aggro first, which means it's going to be a kill. But the save is going to be late to the refight. And Zip's going to be real careful. Flash the way. One hit from dead. Two kills picked up very cleanly. AHQ juggling aggro right. Bang is nearby, though. Well, we'll see if he can get anything. Does have explosive cost, but everyone from AHQ has peeled and back away. Well, here. Here he has the AD carry. Well on the hunt. They've locked Morin down. They're and once again pulls turret aggro. Dredge line pulls Pinky backwards. Westall looks to feast. And that gets two more kills for AHQ. But at what cost? Easy Hoons on the mid lane, the rest of AHQ in the top lane. Easy Hoon can keep pushing here. Yes, Thresh behind him with the lands. Fantastic, fantastic performance. We'll get to that point in a second as Ziv and Marin are trading up here in the top lane. This might turn out to be a big fight. Marin might go Mega Nar. He's about to transform. And he's got reinforcements coming as well. Ziv could not possibly hope to get this kill, but there's two more of SKT coming up here. Easy Hoon, the first in. Ziv playing aggressively without anyone nearby him at all. In comes the slow, in comes Bang. He as well knocks him back into the wall to be safe. Of course, the lane. rest exactly of AHQ is ready to push on in. Mid lane outer turn. Two items to be super, super effective. We also need level 11 on the Cho'Gath before you get enough damage on your feet to start one-shotting targets. Syria is almost getting a Phantom Dancer, so it's not a bad thing that you wait for two item spikes on both Cho'Gap and Sivir before you really go hard on these fights, and it's also what they're trying to do here at HQ. Now they got this mid tower, and but the fight is from Nar coming in, Albus almost going down, he's even down to half, but out goes the rest of the team. Gragas into the fray as well, swap in towards A, but interrupted Westor, yes, but it's a silence, Bane's gonna get shut down, headshot comes through, there's the kill picked up, Mountain forced to run, but Ethan summons the turret, the fight continuing for SKT, they want blood back. We do see the Fetchal Maelstrom jumping in for more kills, AHQ currently one for three need to deal with the azia passive and they will have the numbers to do so a team fight victory after skt started it now they turn their attention to Marin with a minion wave barreling down the middle lane aggressive plays remind you of home at all to fisher it's not really danish music uh, yeah. <laughs> i can't remember where you live now right and on the hunt looking for Marin. albus does have the ability to throw the mine down Dredge line out in a second, what? keeps Marin in place. Even the best players in the world will flash into the wall from time to time. 2,000 HP, SKT have stuck themselves around. AHQ and secures now disengage, the barrier at 24 and a half minutes. They've engaged! They go in! They okay, Wolf okay, and Ed okay. Is taking him down. Now it's risky. Bang. We did see the knock up on Easy Hoon, but Westall goes down. The rest of HQ retreat. And it's still a chase in for SKT. Terracrasser just now picked up. That's a slow on to Ziv. They could probably chain him down. Summoner spells back. There's a knock on in. That's going to be two kills picked up. Into the another lane, and you take the minion wave there, and you just slowly push it up one lane at a time. 
and then you always try and get a few hits on the tower, or you punish SKT if they ever try and go out and fight you. Oh, oh huge risk for so Mountain. So much trouble. And Marn's in the same dire straits right here. Silence comes in, can't turn into Big Nar. That's the kill picked up, but of course, Rek'Sai dies the same moment, but an ulti on the Bang. He is alone right now. A big bounce house for AHQ, and Bang will indeed go down. A two for one with the turret ready to die. AHQ should be able to take this one out as Wolf is unable oh! to do it. Westall jumps onto Bangy. He does get it with the Feral Scream, then turns his attention to Wolf. That's four members of SK Telecom down. Bang Blade going by, but AHQ now on the retreat. On the hunt, used as Dragon has spawned. SKT smelling blood in the water. Can they find the fight? will bring them back into this game. Now, Westo, a giant man there, and forced to retreat. That's a massive knockout from the rupture, and gets a godlike kill onto Bang as Marin is trying to zone him away. And he's got the face of the mountain shield, and he survives. In the back line is the re-engage, and SKT put up the wall. And the wall's gonna give him a lot of time to start chucking down these tanks. Mountain and Ziv trying to chase down Barrier in from Easy in the Lantern that he cannot quite reach. Down he goes as well. Two kills picked up, and that is gonna be a dragon secure for AHQ if they want it. AHQ are trying to do what Fnatic could not. Your team's on the wrong side of the map. It's losing health rapidly. It is going to be picked up by SKT. And will there be an ensuing team fight? It will be most certainly free. We're still looking for target. Easy Hoon and Bengi caught in the pit. Emperor's Divide will keep them alive for a few moments longer. But it's Marin that's gone down and secures yet another kill. Bengi knocked up for 10 million years as it's a double kill for Anne Siva. HQ because there's still a Baron buff ticking on three of these guys. Yeah, One of them being sure. Easy Hoon, who's pretty threatening. HQ actually being pushed out of the base. Ooh, good dodge with the hook. SKT still really want this fight right now. It looks like they want to engage. Look at the teleports on the back line. Ziv, can he fight a priority target? Bang's already been knocked up, and Wolf is the first one that's gone low. Who will be the first victim of the fight as Bengi is trying to zone away and doing a good job. Easy Hoon! Oh, got easy Hoon's help. They've traded one for one, but it's top laner versus AD carry. Bang, landing Acid Hunters onto Ziv. will go down very, very fast if he jumped in the middle of Massive HQ. Massive engage here in the mid lane, cost Mountain and West all their flashes, and Marin forced to hop away. He's going to crunch in against the wall, reducing end. Use that QSS in retreat. Marin may be the first victim, but he... Oh! The, the crit's not enough to get the kill. A dredge line does pull Bang back into the fight. And with and no QSS, in. and was swapped. We'll need to take a look at the main fight as Ziv is pulling the aggro of the entire SKT team. Mountain's low, but not dead yet. Wolf with another lantern, saving himself this time. It's two kills to SKT, as SKT are not dead. They got Mountain, they got Anne, and they're going to get away. Oh! Wow. That's a gigantic rupture. You saw how low the health bars got of SKT play. SKT time to farm themselves back in, but keep in mind they are still low. We are going to see the hype of the kinetic position reversal. Wow. What's going on, guys? I don't know. What's going on here? Time where you run in as a unit and you can always engage on SK Telecom as long as you stay together. You get up that vision control and you deny these picks from happening. Instead, now Westor. Westor gets knocked in. Bangy chopped down a half HP, but Bang's here to put in some damage. Easy who joins the fray as well. This is a 5v4. Morn gets caught up with the mid laner. Drops as well. That's Westor dead. And the fight oh. continues. And down to half. Easy who crushing absolutely everybody. Bang gets the kill credit. Knocks more back in. An absolute slaughter in favor of SKT. And it's an ace. AHQ are down after 40 minutes of hope. SKT look to gain control of the match. They're on the inhibitor turrets and they're looking for more. Step aside, Fager. He's you and he's in town. And he's playing so, so well on this Azir. They can finish the game. They're still 4K behind. SK Telecom punishing AHQ for bad positioning on the map for the last five minutes. And they're the number one seed now. What a, an incredible turnaround. SK Telecom take AHQ down from a 10,000 gold deficit. Undefeated in the group stages at MSI. And SKT sure know how to put on a show. I mean, the same thing happened up against Fnatic. A great early game aggressive team could certainly give the Koreans a few knocks.